Well, Scott, for the past three seasons, Yuna Kim has been living and training in Canada, half a world away from her home in Korea. She's adapted quite nicely to her new surroundings, surroundings that have helped her grow into one of this sport's biggest stars. In the heart of Canada's largest city sits the Granite Skating and Curling Club. Inside, Korea's media darling is preparing for another practice. Today, a television crew from Seoul has come to record her every move. How did 18-year-old Yuna Kim end up here? A brief on-ice tutorial with Canadian skating star Brian Orser led to something much more. She thought he'd make a good coach. He wasn't quite so sure. If you'd asked me 20 years ago if I wanted to coach, I would say, not on your life. Because A, it's like a super full-time job, and I have to put up with people like me, and I don't know if I'm equipped for that. So it's grown on me, and I, and I love it. Do it. Aha, uh -huh, good girl. The move from Korea was inevitable. A country that lacks the facilities and the coaching expertise to support a young skating star. We thought we were better to skate another country because there's no ice rink in time for the athletes. So I would just ask Brian to become my uh, main coach and he said yes. In 2006, Yuna and mother Mahi Park packed their bags for Toronto. The city's sizable Korean population immediately made them feel at home. I feel like I'm living in Korea. So I feel very comfortable. There's a Korean market. I eat Korean food every day. It's very good to train here. Yuna's quickly become one of Korea's most marketable athletes. Even Coach Orser is a celebrity there. I actually get more recognized there than I do anywhere else in Canada. That's pretty funny. Demands on Yuna's time in her homeland are all consuming. Here in Canada, she enjoys some anonymity. But make no mistake, she's a star here as well forcing your coach to take on added responsibilities. I have to um, exercise some management skills, <laughs> and that's a bit of a challenge. But uh, part of my role is not only to teach her skating and to prepare her for these events, but I have to protect her. 